Hey guys, you assembly point. Um, today I'm going to discuss about uh, diffuse esophageal spasm. Okay, uh, diffuse esophageal spasm or a nutcracker esophagus. Okay, let's start. Let me start. Okay. Uh, just as I said, uh, two types. One is a diffuse esophageal spasm and a nutcracker esophagus. They both are very, very related to each other. So, diffuse es esophageal spasm is in which the contractions are uncoordinated, and in a, in a nutcracker esophagus, the contraction proceed in a coordinated manner, but amplitude is excessive. This is a small difference between these two. Okay. Now let me move on to next slide. Okay. Uh, okay. How does it present? The sign and symptoms are a non-cardiac chest pain. So usually the patient presents with a chest pain. Okay. A globus. That is a sensation that an object is trapped in the throat. Okay. Uh, dysphagia, regurgitation, and heartburn. Important points to be noted. Remember in your assembly, sometimes they give. Uh, a patient comes to your office and he says he has a difficulty in swallowing and they will mention somewhere that it is precipitated by the cold liquids very important point you need to note precipitated by liquid cold liquids this is very important then it's a diffuse esophageal spasm okay management how do you manage barium studies barium studies show corkscrew pattern corkscrew right are winding right narrowing and square uh, winding like this uh, the accurate test what is the most accurate test is going to be yes manometric studies very important what does it show it shows a high intensity disorganized contractions high intensity disorganized contraction sometimes in usmle they give uh, manometric studies shows high intensity disorganized the contraction what is the diagnosis that's it right so, so you need to remember everything treatment remember how do you treat it uh, treat is a calcium channel blockers can reduce the amplitude of the contractions like nifedipine and nitrates can be also be used okay so this is all about uh, diffuse esophageal spasm and nutcracker esophagus you should know how to differentiate it from uh, other types like uh, dysphagia like due to esophageal cancer esophagitis uh, zencus diverticulum achalasia okay thank you so much for watching my video please do subscribe